all right youtubers hope everyone is well little idea for a video uh staying in this place tonight um picking up a car at the weekend so thought i'd do the bulk of the journey the day before before collecting the car tomorrow if that makes sense it's about 200 mile drive so hopefully all goes well and the reason for doing this video um usually i'd stay in a hotel or like a premier inn or something um but one of my mates recommended to you know look around on like booking.com etc and you can find these nice little cottages and there's been a couple that i've stayed at you know collecting a car and this is the third one and i'm just amazed at the value like yes it is a little difficult to find these places we have to go down country roads and you have to go down a dark path but Honestly, the reason I'm doing this video now, I'm just so impressed with like the interior design, the furniture, the cleanliness, the space. It's just insane. Like a Premier Inn, you know, it can range from £40 to, well, £200 in London. But this was £200 for one night, Saturday night, and uh, near Kidderminster. And... Just, I mean, it's amazing. So I'm just going to basically, any time I do stay away now in some of these places, just do a little video just to show people's taste, their, you know, furniture, design. Because I think it really, you know, I just think it's really nice. It just impresses me, stuff like this, because I'd, I'd have no clue of interior design. But, like, this furniture, really nice furniture. So this is the upstairs. We've got a nice sofa there. Wi-Fi, which you don't have to pay for extra, like Premier Inn, the high-speed one. You got a footstool, nice curtains, central heating, double glazing, the lights there, Velux windows, decent sized TV. Um, there's a bit of sort of artwork here. I mean, come on, that beats a Premier in. It just honestly, it's just, I just it just really impresses me. This rug, two chairs there. This is definitely one of the the nicest out of the uh, three places I've stayed at compared to a hotel room. Table and chairs there. This furniture is really nice. I really like this. We've got some tissues. You know, it's just really clean. Oh, we've got more pillows in there. Like, literally, I've, I've been here for like less than an hour and it just. Oh, it's just. It's, it's, it's a shame. I'm only staying here for one night, just flowers there. Like I say, 200 quid for one night. This is bedroom number one. You know, furniture, it's really just clean, new. The, these people have got it sus. The people that are renting these out or, you know, offering these to people. Um, it seems they're sort of a possibly retired, semi-retired. They've invested in property. This is the annex. So, you know, getting a rental income or, you know, letting it out for... Oh, that seems to be locked. Okay, we'll leave that one. Um, <laughs> yeah, just... It's like a library, this is. Um, even this I saw, like... Yeah, so basically, this is like their retirement. And, you know, 200 quid a night, this will be fully booked in the summer. You know, you're putting in a grand a week. And the building's going up in value. It's beautiful, it really is. Love these old locks as well had this before in the old cottage I stayed at I can't remember how you do it you just I can't remember now but it, it's yeah it's quite it's quite cool so that's the upstairs really spacey um, then you go downstairs outside as well there's like seating area but obviously not going to use that because it's December so this is the second bedroom I'm going to stay in this one oh mini reflection We've got a seat there you can sit down on, pillow. I mean, just, you know, honestly, like I said, if you want to stay somewhere for a week, I did not know these places exist. The lights, really nice lights. Bit of artwork on there. Um, nice bed. Towels included. Um, shower gel, etc. Even like this. Coaster. 
lamp. It's going to work. I know it's going to work. Yeah. Just really, really impressed. 200 quid. Just so much more space compared to a Premier Inn. You got your fridge, freezer, cooker, coffee maker, free little complimentary glass of wine, some crisps, that's the wine, some chocolate, another television, sofa, more nice furniture, those lovely lights again, big curtains, outside seating area, which obviously I can't show you because it's dark, and the hosts are next door. Don't want to disturb them because it is nearly, nearly midnight. Toaster, kettle, tea, coffee, stools. Like honestly, last thing to show you is the bathroom. But uh, my mate's in there at the minute. He's going to be driving back my Rover while I drive back the new car. Nothing special. The car's like eight hundred and fifty quid, but it was such a bargain. I had to go for it. Yeah, it's just mad. So two hundred quid. Can't go wrong. Washing machine there if you need it. Yeah, just just lovely interior design. Honestly, I love seeing people's taste. Uh, very impressed. So I'll show you the bathroom last, and yeah, that will conclude. All right, yeah. So once again, this is the this is the downstairs bedroom, and if you walk through this door, which also leads to the uh, the bottom of the stairs. This is the bathroom. Not the biggest bathroom, but it's all you need. Nice tiles. And uh, yeah. Little, have a glass of wine from this. Maybe a bit too big, but. Yeah, it's nice. So there we go. Just a quick walk around of uh, one of the places available on these websites, which I actually didn't know existed. Always just look for hotels, as I've said, and uh, yeah, very good value. And very nice design, very clean, so. There we go. Hope you enjoyed, and over and out. Right, YouTubers, bit of bonus footage. So I picked up the car, really pleased with it. Um, really happy with it, might do a video on that at some point. Uh, so yeah, um, didn't get much sleep last night, about three hours, so instead of driving back over 200 miles, which would have been, un bit, which would have been a bit unsafe, um, had a look on the old websites again, booking.com, not sponsoring them or anything, but found this at the last minute, uh, yeah, very different. Uh, £110 a night, lovely view on the way in, it's basically just like in the middle of nowhere, really bumpy track though, the suspension was bumping up and down like crazy, so I hope I haven't damaged anything, but yeah, £110 a night this one, so a bit of bonus footage, first room, we have the bed, um, the host was, in my opinion, uh, you could call it rude or blunt, basically turned up and... She was like, what are you here for? Because they've got a few cottages here. And we were like, this one. And she was like, well, right, go and park over there then. The one where it says where you're supposed to be. And we were like, oh, sorry, you know, it's dark. Park there. And she's like, come on, you can move back a bit more. I was like, oh, hello to you too. You know, just a completely different vibe. Um, yeah, we have an interesting picture here. But maybe that's just how some people are. Plant. Yeah, I mean, it's just all right. So this is the double bedroom. Friendship isn't a big thing. It's a million little things. Is this, is this like valuable? Bin. Yeah, just like the furniture, nowhere near as nice the other place. I know it's half the price, but there is some subtle, difference with, subtle differences, which you'll see in a minute. So like I said, I ain't had much sleep. Some lovely roses there. Picture. It's basically sort of where we are, really. Oh, yeah, that's the road we come up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the lamp. Nothing like that urn lamp. But sheets are nice and clean. Nice fresh sheets. Another lamp there. That I had to put the bulb in. It was loose. But uh, does this one work? Let's have a look. 
Yeah, that one works. But look, just the difference in quality, you know. But uh, doors, oh god, there's a love heart there. So this is it. Nowhere near as spacey as the other one. The Wi-Fi is absolutely shit. There's the dining table. Nowhere near as good as obviously the last one we were at. Um, the time is wrong on the clock. It doesn't seem to move. Fire exit, if you fancy jumping out of the window. Random. Cupboards and that. Yeah, just like, even like, obviously for the kids, nowhere near as much cutlery. But you know, it's still nice. It's not bad. Um, oh, apparently it has uh, spring water, which is treated as well. One thing that was nice was they have milk. They've given us milk. Toaster, kettle, sort of like a premier in kettle. But, you know, 110. Just, just showing you the difference, really. Bit of bonus footage. So, there's no smoking signs everywhere as well. That's a good little original feature, the... Uh, the original windows, which is quite cool. Little table there, chair. Showers in there, um, show you that last. And here is the other bedroom. It's a bit like a cell, this one. Um, yeah. So, there you go. But it's still cool. Still cool. So, overall, can't knock it, as good as a hotel room really. So uh, yeah, that's what I'll show you, so thanks for watching once again and uh, good luck if you are staying away and you fancy uh, a change from a hotel room and find a little uh, cottage or apartment. Like this one, but this is nowhere near near as nice as the one we set last night. And there's some funny smells around here, but that's I'm not going to complain. It's somewhere nice to say stay. So I'd love to show you the views, but obviously it's pitch black outside. So anyway, that's that. I'll show you the bar from last. It's nothing special. I'll still be really misty, isn't it? Little picture. And finally the bathroom. That's a bit misty in here because of a shower. Uh, interesting to uh, see carpet rather than a hard floor. So yeah. Le Rose. Just an ordinary shower really. And that's about it. So yeah. Finally, thanks for watching, and if you want to see any more videos like this, not sure if people do or not, feel free to leave a comment or uh, suggest some, uh, tell us some stories about places you've stayed at. Get in there.